Ian from Lane Media. Today I'm going to show you how to make changes to user permissions in Amazon Seller Central. This video helps. Please take a moment to like it. Follow me. Let's get started. So what I'm looking at right now is the user permissions for one of the service providers I work with, one of the professional service providers. I've done other videos explaining how you should be really careful with the ser service providers you give access to in terms of accessing your Seller Central account. I'm going to talk about how to change the permissions for what they can and cannot do. And Amazon has this gigantic checklist of uh, permissions for very specific features on Amazon Seller Central. And you can set them to be none. That is the, the service provider. They won't have any access to like your A plus content manager. View, which means they can look at the data or they can look at the feature, but they can't make changes. View and edit, which means they can look at it and make changes. And admin, which means that not only can they do all of this stuff, viewing and editing, but they can also ask, invite other people to come in to do stuff. So uh, view and edit and admin, as you can imagine, those are very sensitive areas and you should be very careful when you're granting uh, administrative access to user permissions in Amazon Seller Central. So what I'm gonna be doing right now is I'm going to be going through and making a few changes to some of these particular features. And it's pretty simple. Um, well, actually, it's not that simple because there's a lot of features, but the, act the actual act of doing it is simple. So I know that the service provider needs access to A plus content manager and campaign manager. And I know this because they told me and also because this is the this is the uh, service that I want them to help me manage. So I know they need access to this stuff. So I'm going to change. And they've, they said it needs to be view and edit for both of them. So I'm going to check that off. And by the way, the... Uh, the red and the green here. This is because I've already made some edits and then I had to go back and uh, make some changes and it basically showed what I'd been doing before. So I'm changing this to view and edit for the, for A plus content manager and campaign manager. And then down here, I noticed that um, for some reason they had loan registration access. I, I don't want that. I don't, they don't, they do not handle loans for me and I don't want them to register for Amazon loans. So I'm going to, I'm going to change that to none. And Later on, if they say, oh, Ian, you know, we're having an issue with such and such a feature, or maybe it's tied to loan registration, they can tell me and I can make a change. So that's not a big deal. So I just downgraded that service, but then I upgraded these two services to view and edit. Once you're done, go to the very bottom of the screen, click continue. You'll have to review all this stuff again, all the changes you just made, and they'll be highlighted in red and green. And if you're okay with that, save changes and you're good to go.